Hi, Dot here from First National Palm Beach. I wanted to talk to you today about um, arrears. It's a very important topic in uh, the current crisis. Now, here in Queensland, uh, the government has said there is a moratorium on evictions for six months uh, for rental arrears. Now, if a tenant has been a chronic uh, offender of rental arrears, the court, the QCAT, will still look at it. Um, if a landlord needs to take possession of his property and the property's on a periodic tenancy, you can still give two months notice. If a property's for sale, we can still give the tenant notice. Uh, it's only for if, if a tenant has been directly uh, affected by COVID-19, i.e. they've lost their job and they're experiencing hardship. Um, so we're really, really taking um, this very seriously as far as our arrears is concerned. At the moment, our arrears are running um, they're tracking where they normally track. I'm, I'm not surprised at all that we haven't had a huge increase in our arrears. So at the moment, um, tenants uh, running at two days um, in arrears and under are running at 3%, which is well, well, well below industry standard. And for um, a tenant running seven days or more, which then goes into notice periods, is 0.5%. So that's, uh, that's well below industry standard. Um, we had 66 applications in March. Now, why that's important is because normally we would track um, well up into the 90s or 100s. Um, and of those, we um, selected 19 applications. So 19 applications were successful. The two things we can discriminate against are ability to pay and ability to, to maintain. So of those 66 applications, only 19 of those fitted our criteria. So there's a lot of applications out there that are going to other properties and other agents uh, that don't fit the strict criteria that we have. Um, we're sending out targeted email marketing um, and just say, for example, I had a house in Palm Beach, I would be sending out a targeted email SMS marketing campaign and that would probably go to a minimum of 800 tenants just for that one particular property. Um, our properties are leasing quite quickly um, for many reasons. We're very, very big on our technology, um, software, hardware, technology. Um, we utilize every single thing we can. So Matterports, 3D walkthroughs, um, highlighted um, ad advertisements on REA. And um, at the moment, we're working really hard on properties that are coming vacant with getting the tenants permission to actually use their furniture and their environment that they've created within their home to film our 3D walkthroughs. And then we're encouraging all of the potential tenants to view that, um, view that walkthrough prior to us organising an inspection. And we will actually sign a lease agreement if they're happy to sign a lease agreement on the information that's been provided on that 3D walkthrough, we are more than happy to sign a lease agreement on that on that um, on that 3D walkthrough. So um, at the moment, um, running really um, amazing open houses. The girls are working really hard doing one-on-ones. Uh, they're hard work because sometimes you could be at a property for two hours, two and a half hours, doing them every 15 minutes apart. But if that's what we need to do to get these properties leased, that's what we're going to do. So the offices, are effectively, the doors are locked at the moment, but we are open for business six days a week. We have all of our team members on deck. Um, if anybody's got any concerns, please give me a call, 0412 455 808. I'm more than happy to take your call. Otherwise, just send your, uh, your property manager a quick email and she'll come back to you um, same day. So uh, thanks very much. And um, here's hoping we come out the other end of this in better shape than when we went in. So uh, good luck.